Hi, this is Bert here, and uh, on behalf of SAB Heli Division, I want to uh, answer a few questions you guys may have about the Goblin 380. Um, there's lots of questions coming in. Uh, how much does it cost? When is it going, going to be available? What colors does it come in? Um, a lot of these questions are still unanswered, unfortunately. Um, as far as release date, uh, we're aiming for December. However, as you guys know, release dates might change depending on a multitude of factors. Once we get a more specific date, which should come up in the next few weeks we will obviously announce it um, as far as price same situation we're still trying to determine the best possible price that we can um, we can uh, give these machines but uh, it'll depend on a lot of different factors during production and so forth once again once we have the price we will we will announce it we will try to make this the most affordable goblin ever of course and uh, colors we have lots of different colors. Uh, that doesn't mean that all these colors will be available. We will initially release two different colors. Again, we're uh, getting some feedback and doing some tests here in manufacturing to see uh, what colors are, are the, the best uh, to produce. But uh, just to give you a quick idea and rundown about the model, um, this is the easiest, uh, I guess you could say, uh, a model with the least amount of parts that Goblin's ever made. It probably rivals other helicopters in its size in terms of the number of parts. Uh, 38 total different parts in this machine. That doesn't mean you only have 38 parts, but different parts. Um, <clears throat> a lot of simplicity was thought um, from the very beginning. For example, the head design is very simple. You only have one bolt to clamp the uh, the head instead of two bolts uh, and as you move down throughout the uh, the head and you reach the frame you, you can find again a lot of simplicity in this model only one bolt to adjust the tension on the motor belt uh, only one bolt to uh, secure the boom to the frame so it's really really easy to install and uh, and remove the boom you just tighten up one single bolt and as all other goblins it has the same feature uh, that uh, saves the boom in the event of a crash there's only one attachment point for the boom and again it's a nylon bolt so very easy to save the boom during a crash um, we've gotten some feedback about the looks of the machine they say it's a mini speed machine not really um, we went with this look because it's a very popular look we've gotten a lot of positive feedback from the goblin speed looks um, but uh, this is an all well-rounded uh, uh, mini machine meaning that it can obviously fly very fast but it's of course designed to do 3d and sport flying and it's great for beginners as well as advanced pilots um, in the future, once this machine releases, it'll have a really neat feature, which is um, it'll have an automatic battery connect and disconnect. So as you insert the battery tray into the machine, it'll automatically connect itself. Um, other than that, uh, again, some comments about the looks. Uh, the landing gear, some people think it's not stable, but it is really stable. It's very flexible also, so it can handle uh, a pretty good landing, a heart landing or a heart crash. Um, and again, a lot of simplicity throughout the machine. When you look at it, you realize that uh, there's just not a whole lot going on here in terms of uh, number of parts and how easy things are uh, put together. So we're really excited about the release. Again, I know you guys have a lot of questions. Um, if you have any questions, please visit my Facebook. It's uh, facebook.com slash Bert, R-C, B-E-R-T-R-C. Um, post your questions there. I've been really busy lately, but I'll do my best to answer all the questions you guys may have. And, uh, of course, some questions I can't answer simply because we don't have an answer for those yet. But uh, as soon as we get more information, we'll bring it to you. So, again, looking forward to the release of these guys. Uh, this is just a, a beautiful machine, and uh, I know you guys will enjoy it as much as I have during my testing.